Yo, I did over five years of my life in prison, then built a six-figure-plus business, and I'm getting ready to show you step-by-step -step how you can make offers online and make money fast. Yo, what is cracking? Zachary Babcock here with UnderdogEmpowerment.com. If you stick around to this whole entire video, I'm going to completely reverse engineer how to make money online fast, thousands of dollars. Uh, and I did over five years of my life in prison and built a six-figure plus business. So literally anybody with a grind can do this. Now, before we get into this, let me show you my income statement so you know that I'm not on no faking stuff. All right, so here's a snapshot of my QuickBooks. Um, let's go ahead and look at this month. Uh, so we made 27,321 so far this month off of running offers, which I'm getting ready to show you how to do. Let's also take a look at so far year to date. And you'll see that we broke just recently broke uh, 100K this year. And that's why I'm making this video. Notice I didn't start making any money until March is when I broke through. So all this has been done in, in eight months worth of time. All right, first things first, man. I'm not going to give you no fluff and uh, give you no quick get rich quick thing that you're probably used to seeing on the internet. If that's what you came to this video for, you probably want to keep scrolling because I'm going to keep it real with you. And I'm going to tell you like it is, man. The first thing you got to do is you have to build actual tangible skills, valuable skills in the marketplace that people will actually pay money for. There's no shortcuts. There's no skipping steps you have to build character and skills in order to start making money in your business online or offline so what I did is I actually developed skills in podcasting I became a top rated podcaster on my third day of launching and then I just stuck to it and got really really good over the course of the year I learned how to interview celebrities I learned how to grow my podcast downloads organically by over a thousand each and every month I learned how to uh, get it ranked like I mentioned and also how to monetize directly from the podcast and I spent over a year working on this and developing my craft before I actually took those skills to the marketplace so what you have to think about is what are some skills that you currently have that you could bring to the marketplace or what are some skills that you could develop that would be very valuable to the marketplace next up if you're gonna make offers online and actually make some money you're gonna to have to get really good at positioning so after you have these skills developed some valuable skills that you can offer to the marketplace you have to get good at positioning yourself in the marketplace as a credible source of information that somebody would actually want to do business with what I did was I consistently interviewed top celebrity guests like Grant Cardone Andy Frasilla John Lee Dumas Neil Patel on and on and on uh, and consistently did that and also showed my downloads growth each and every month showing how I was consistently growing that and show that how I had my podcast ranked on Apple, which positioned me as a credible podcaster and that someone actually knows something about podcasting. So you could do that with YouTube. You could do that with Instagram. It don't even have to be a social media channel. You could be uh, really good at lead generation. What are some things that you're good at that you could start to begin to showcase and demonstrate your authority in the marketplace? All right, now we've done the work. Now it's time to get to the good stuff. We put in the work. We're ready to make some actual money. So what you got to do uh, to make money online without having to run advertisements, which I'm not saying you shouldn't run advertisements, but let's talk about the organic strategy. In order to be able to do that, you have to make a hard offer versus a soft offer. So let me quickly explain what that is. A hard offer is something very specific, concrete, and tangible versus a soft offer is kind of, eh, you, you see them all the time. You'll say, you see people say, I'll help you grow your business. Like, Come on, man, for real. Is are, Would you pull out your wallet and pay somebody that says they'll help you grow their business? Unless they're like uh, Russell Brunson or, or Tony Robbins or whoever, um, you're probably not going to do it unless they're already a celebrity person that has a well-known track record. So that's a soft offer. You want to make a hard offer that is very specific, and there's three key components to a hard offer. Number one, a hard offer offers a specific benefit that your audience actually wants. And number two, and I'm going to explain, I'm going to give you an example. Number two, um, a hard offer also has a vehicle in which how you're going to reach the benefit. And then third and finally, a hard offer has a time frame in which that benefit will be obtained. So for an example, instead of making a soft offer, I'll help you grow your business. You could say, I'll help you become a top rated podcaster and become a celebrity in your marketplace and be a top rated podcaster on iTunes in five weeks or less. See, I hit the benefit. They want to be a celebrity status. It's going to bring them more income and influence within their marketplace. We're going to do that by becoming a top-rated podcaster on Apple, and we're going to do that in five weeks or less. That's a hard offer. Now, let me show. Let's go back to the screen. I'm going to show you exactly what a hard offer looks like and how I made this offer specifically on Facebook. 
All right, here's a hard offer that I ran on Facebook not too long ago on September 30th. This was my birthday. Now notice in here I have the benefits. I have them bullet pointed out of what they'll get, which is the hard offer, which is rank your podcast on Apple five weeks or less, generate at least 1K month directly from your podcast, 90 days or less, grow your monthly downloads by 1K every month, 60 days or less, and interview celebrities constantly 60 days or less. And then they also get one month of our free production services. And I go on here, and I'm just literally making a quick, short offer. I've already did so much positioning in my marketplace to where people know that I'm the legit real deal because we have over 30 clients with 100% success rate with this offer. So I didn't have to put a whole, whole lot in the copy. But one thing that you're going to want to do is to hit on their pain points of not having uh, what they want, the end goal of being uh, making money and have an influence in the marketplace. That would be for my audience. It might be different for yours. And then also paint the future for them and then also make a special offer um, that that they get. It's make it special, make it something unique and that also has some scarcity to it. So for this one, we're only doing 10 people and I'm only running this for two days. That's what I did for that. And it got a lot of buzz and we were able to generate a lot of sales. So what you do after you make this offer, uh, I said, if you're you're smart and hungry and you're ready to get these results, then send me a message to lock it in. And what they would do is they would send me a message on Facebook saying they're interested. We would then hop on a phone call. I would then uh, pick apart their brain of what their goals are for their podcast. First, I would ask them what about this offer stuck out to them. They tell me, then I know that's a pain point. Then I ask them what their goals are. And then after they tell me their goals, I assure them that we'll help them achieve that. And then I ask them, uh, I tell them, hey, it's 5K offer. You're going to get this, this, and this, and then we'll move forward. Are you ready to do this? And when they say yes, I send them an invoice, and then we get started in a group coaching program. All right, so that brings us to our next point. We're almost finished here. I went and had, if you notice, I have an agency model where we actually have our employees that produce podcasts for these podcasters because that's where the real money is. We get people in the door for 5K to help them get their podcast launched and get all these four awesome uh, kick-ass benefits that come with being a podcaster. We help them be rock star podcasters. However, they got pain points now because they don't want to have to produce their own podcast all the time because there's a lot of work that goes into it. So what I did is I went overseas and I found a team to build an agency with so that we could produce those podcasts for them. And so that's something that you could do if you offer like a service-based model. You could find people overseas and have a team and build an agency model around it. And that's reoccurring monthly income that comes in month after month after month. You don't have to go out hunting to find a new sale each and every month. You got some security going there. And I'm going to link up my favorite place that I outsource to in the comments below if you want to check that out and make your next hire. All right, so there you have it. Here's a bird's eye view of the whole entire model, your business model, what you could set up. This is an example. There's plenty of different ways. I'm just showing you how I set up mine. Set up an offer that you have that you can help people get specific results with a hard offer, and then you offer it to them on Facebook, and it's like a group coaching or consulting where you help them get these specific results. That's the front end money that gets them in the door, and then have something on the back end, which is a reoccurring every single month monthly income coming in where you provide a service to help them continue to do what they need to do, and that's how you set it up, and then you can run your offer. I do mine every two to three months. You could do it however you want. I like to spread it out that way. That's why I'm not always putting out an offer and what this will allow you to do is to really hone in your offer and get it really dialed in and then you can move into things like paid advertising which is something that we're going to be moving into now now that we have built the systems and processes in our agency model and we have our offer so dialed in we're ready to take on a high volume of uh, new clients I have one more gift for you that I want you to have before you go but really quickly if you enjoyed this video if that was some heat if this helped out in any way shape or form make sure you hit subscribe so you can continue to get the number one resource for you to build a passive income business. Make sure you hit like on this video if you liked it, but if it sucked, you can go ahead and hit it with a thumbs down. Now, what I want to give you is if you are uncertain how to actually do this, because this isn't going to happen overnight, I want to redirect you to a spot that might help you get a head start, and that is by actually starting a podcast. And I got a video, complete free tutorial video right here on YouTube. Uh, matter of fact, go check out that video right there and the three other videos that follow it. And it's gonna show you exactly everything you need to know on how to start and launch a podcast. And that's gonna do amazing for you as far as positioning. I went from five years in prison to a six figure plus business owner all through indirectly my podcast. Go check it out.